logarithm. Uh, and I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna do something a little bit tricky. It is not tricky. It's just I'm gonna multiply everything with ten in order to in order to appreciate the percentages instead of just having zero point zero five. Does that everyone understand what I'm doing? Instead of writing here, I mean I can write it down like that. Let's let's write that. Average of uh, average of investment over GDP is thirty five percent. So thirty five percent is over five. Yeah. Now you're gonna see that because this, that is a percentage, just a percentage, all my numbers of the logarithm is gonna, are gonna be negative, right? So, I mean, the, the reason, I mean, I'm, I'm gonna have something like this. Instead of being like this thing that I want, they're gonna be like this. I mean, the relationship is still the same. Uh, how they're gonna be is still the same. But how, it, it's nicer to work with positive numbers. An easy way to work with these kind of regressions in which you take into consideration percentages is just multiply everything by 100 or take any percentage. So, you get rid of it. So, we work with percentages, or he works with percentages. Logarithm of realize that here I have it with in, in, in number, not in percentage. So I have to multiply this guy. Eta plus delta plus g is gonna be equal to logarithm of this guy plus this guy times 100, right? And here I have 2%. Oh, the logarithm of 2%, right? Am I able to do that? At least for uh, consistency purposes, from the, the other one is log of 100 times the same as three. No, because you, what you can do is you can absorb it, everything in the absolute. Oh, no, I'm just talking about the label up there. The what? The, how do you label that? What do you mean? Are, are you just gonna, going to keep them like that? Because technically, that's not. You're using percentages, right? I'm using S as a percentage and F as a percentage. As a percentage. If I multiply this by 100 and divide it by 100, then this over 100 will yes. go outside as minus logarithm of 100. Yes. The same this, the same this part. We'll multiply by alpha over 100. Yes. Call epsilon. Is that call epsilon? 